figure my legs what legs are doing here. My legs are like really confused at what's going on. I'm like sitting, I'm sitting cross-legged on my computer chair because this chair is extremely uncomfortable. This chair is really greasy looking. I might like... Oh yeah, we just met Skid back by a ship. Wait here, we'll take care of it. You two are true heroes. I mean that. No, too many people, too many bits. Star client, please find him. Yeah. Wait, okay, so. Do I go over there? Over there. Yeah, okay, I don't think I can go over there quite yet. All right, we return the ship. Perhaps we should explore Skid Sports Shack again. There may be something useful there. Did I get something? It's sport. Didn't get something. It's sport shack, dude. Son of a bitch. Someone, uh, someone might have fucked up a little bit. I'm fucked up. Also, do you want me to change that to something better or no? Yeah, you know, like, like when I say, well, we fucked up. No, I think it's hilarious. Okay. Nine thousand euros, dude. Dude, is Bravely Default any good? Uh, I want to. I want to play it. It looks really good. I, do you want to borrow my copy? Uh, I might have to, yeah. I have it. Oh dear. Um, I never, I never finished it though. Here we go, 12 hour stream, dude. I wish. <laughs> I've, I've got to work early tomorrow. I would, I would do a 12 hour stream. Or attempt to do it again. I only went 10 hours. Because I'm a cheap ass. Cheap ass who? Uh, ow! Oh my god! It's for a butt ton. You found Skid yet? How's it going, Maddie? Dude, what we gotta say? This are you guys ready for the secret password? It's in Is fact, it dude, it's in fact woe, dude. Amen. Goddamn. You have my chat open, man. Yeah. Oh. Hi, Maddie. Uh, still, still dying a shit ton in Dark Souls. Sorry, I, I noticed, like, Maddie's first, too, and then I didn't notice the second one, because I'm still blue name. Yeah. Uh, how's this game? It's really fun. It's enough of a reboot where things... Like, I'm recalling a bunch of the original game, right? But then at the same time, I am it's new enough. They've, like, added enough stuff where it feels like a completely game. They've referenced a lot of it, though, which is really funny. What is this? Ratchet and Clank found a portable hydro displacer designed by Dr. Nefarious. This ingenious device promised to move water from one place to the Dude, other. Dude, I've got all the water in my gun now. Is it in fact a water gun? Dude, it is in fact all of the water in one gun. Nice. Sounds like kind of intense. Okay. I don't know. Oh, good though. Damn is it? 337. Oh, no. Talked actually. Oh, good of. Oh, it's a bolt. Of course, Ratchet knew he'd have to surface to breathe. Oh, dude. Oh, I died. I literally got to the surface and died. <laughs> oh. I need 300. Like a bunch of bullshit. Did I get that? Learning the controls for this. For the PS thing is. And that's the only thing I'm not gonna like about going back to PS4. Or going back to PlayStation. I do not like their controller. Really? I love the controller. I don't like having the analog stick on the bottom. It's so much more comfortable to have it up top. Like that's the only reason why I like really like the Xbox controller, is because I can I can move around with, you know, free movement in circles while also still being able to fully control the camera. That's the only reason why I really like it. I don't know, I'm a, I'm a huge fan of the, the... I like the PlayStation controller almost more. 
whatever it's called, the, the Xbox controller. But I'm, I'm, but also you gotta remember I've been playing on analog. I'm a billion percent with Lloyd. I don't know. I just, I really enjoy the PlayStation controller. I don't. I think the, I think this is a better controller platform. I think wow. that the Xbox controller is much better in a platform. If you're in a shooter situation. Well, that is typically the games I play, so I guess it works. So I will give you that. Let's see if we can help out Thank you. I, I do, I do feel you. You hate the PlayStation controller? I don't like the new setup for the new one, but it feels so natural to me. I mean, I, I, I never played on an Xbox. I never owned an Xbox. Like, I only owned the PlayStation, Nintendo consoles, and then the PlayStation 2. So I never was privy to how how the Xbox controller worked. I didn't like it. It had too many buttons. It had, like, color buttons and X and Y buttons. And it was just like, I don't know what's going on. So buttons. You want to know another thing that uh, might, have, might, might sway me more towards the Xbox controller? I play... <coughs> um, my, the console that I play the most of as a, as a kid, which makes it a little bit sad because I never... Actually, I oh don't know, I guess it makes sense. I played the N64 and, um, was it the GameCube? Yeah. And they both have analog sticks as your left thumb. I guess that's true. And I guess that, and, well, aside from the 64, they're all in the same spot. They're, they're top right. They're top left. I'm sorry. Got it. Oh dear, I've got several sand stars coming toward me. And if I did not, if I had to choose between... A PlayStation 4 controller and a GameCube controller. I hate saying it. I'd probably go with a GameCube controller. But that's only because I, I played so much on it. The C stick would drive me nuts, though. Shapes are easy. Yeah. That that's it. I don't know. I I'm just. I guess it, it comes from a lot of being that I played a lot on, like, I'm out of ammo for my, my, my best gun. Maybe it's just me, but I, I really do enjoy me a good mission. I think, I think the PlayStation controller did, like, the PS4 controller was a great upgrade, but it's, it's got its part. I need to get the, uh, what is that? An Xbox One controller. Just, just see what it feels like. I personally, I don't like them. I think that they they bulked up a controller that didn't need bulking up. Is it more bulky? Mm -hmm. yeah. At least in my opinion, it's a bulkier controller. Dude, I forgot I can fucking throw my wrench. What have I been doing with my life? You are also technically more pervy to. Uh... Awesome. You're also more entitled. Well, not. You like the PlayStation 4 controller more, and the PlayStation. I'll give. I'll give the PlayStation controllers this. Um, it is. Uh, they're very thin, which is very nice to hold. Yeah, they are. That was. A, that was a really surprising difference. Is that they are a much thinner design than the. Actually. Uh, Maddie actually does have a. What is yeah. the Xbox Elite controller? So, for the Xbox One, you have the standard controller, then you have the Elite controller. And I think the Elite controller has... You can actually take out and remove, or like... Actually, no, I remember what it is. You can, uh, you know, your D-pad? You can actually have it be um, either, like, normal, or you can actually turn it to where it's an X. For I guess that sort of a difference. I think there's that difference. There's a few other button type differences too. And I don't know if they actually changed the shape or size to it, but it looks it looks nicer. And of course, I think that's the one where you can actually like change up the buttons. Uh, I think you're right on that one. I don't know. I mean, I'm I'm need to say it. I'm probably gonna get an X one. Well, you're gonna have to. 
Like, I don't know, the PS the PS4 has a good game selection, but not what I thought it was going to be. And honestly, the PlayStation the X1 has a better game selection. Like overall, and four extra bucks. But I gotta judge it, cause like they're down to 270 now, something like that. I think like 300. I don't know. It, they've gotten a lot lower. And I don't know, the X1. It's got some titles on it I want to play. I mean, one of these days, I mean, hell, I could. It's, I mean, I've, I've thought about it a lot, actually. Buying an. Oh, Sand Sharks, dude. Oh, so. Wait, no, it's not. Oh, so it's like a Steam controller. That Those kind of paddles. Nice. That was pretty awesome. I was just gonna say, I actually like that about the Steam controller that it had those. But there's too many things wrong with the Steam controller for me to really like it. And also, it doesn't help that, uh, what is it? I don't like on the Steam controller that the, uh, that the stick is so far away. It feels like I'm overstretching just to get to the freaking, uh, really? to get to the actual, like, stick itself. It just doesn't feel that comfortable. It's in a weird location. I know they had to make the um, the haptic controls like really big, but I really wanted them to put maybe a little bit more emphasis on where they put the stick and the buttons. I don't know. I like the Steam controller. Like I like I, honestly, this is one of the the Steam controller is the best the best designed controller I've probably ever felt in my life. Not for me. It, it feels so weird in my hand. Like if they could have cut off maybe about a quarter of an inch from like the weird bumps on the very front of it, oh, it'd be so much more comfortable. Like extend out the back like what they did with the Xbox G60 controller. Like, not well, not like the full back, but like that. God, if I could actually. Show you uh, like the, the back of the of where you hold it, so it's actually more like a, like a cup in your hands, not a uh, not like a flatter surface. Yeah, I think I like it better that way, but probably won't make that one. I can't do my toes. Lloyd does not have well, Lloyd, you have I have medium sized hands. Yeah, you have medium. We're offering cash prizes and hollow cards. It is actually because so I think across the well, the I have was wide, medium-sized hands. Yeah, because I mean I've got giant hands. I mean I got Viking. I have Viking hands. I mean that. Because I can go and buy like a pair of gloves and medium-sized gloves are just a tiny bit too small. <laughs> Because wow, my hands are too wide, which is actually kind of interesting. Because since I have, I don't have big hands. Revolvers shouldn't work for me. Revolvers are the only thing I can handle. Really? I, I suck at semi-autos unless it's like a low-caliber semi-auto. Um, revolvers. God, I shine at revolvers. Find top secret blar reader. I also just love revolvers in general. They are my preferred, uh, my they, preferred They are setting. nice fucking gun. Like, I really wanted to get into, uh, to western shooting, if I could. But... I'm gonna show off my control, my other controller real quick. I've got this here. I think i Star Wars. For my Star Wars theme. Or, which you can't see, because it's under my desk. Got a big old Darth Vader on. Big old Darth Vader. I even have uh, what's it called? Clank and I are in position and ready to commence uh, Operation Falling game. Star. Disney Infinity. Of the Star Wars. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna You're play. play I'll monitor your position from here. I really don't like the whole Disney Infinity My thing. Have up one of but then again, I'm also not like the biggest fan for Amiibos. I think that they have their place. I think it's actually. I think that the whole the whole little modular doohickey things. I think they've got I think they've got a very solid place in the game right now because I think it gives it, it gives kids something they can look for. I mean, yeah, I gotcha. Because like because like when I was a kid, I would have died. Out of to fucking it's like cool. I could just play Spyro with all my favorite characters and then new favorite characters. You know? I would have killed for that, but fortunately we didn't. 
it just got just fine. Like, don't get me wrong. But I think a lot of